I knew this time would come, but I never guessed it would be so soon. There's no secret that I'm a new creator and that I also recently began Twitch streaming. It's fun and I actually do enjoy it, but for the time being, I think it's time for me to actually take a break. What's up guys, it's Neroku, back at it again for a brand new video. Today I have an announcement, or some announcements for you guys, and I'm using this video to talk to you guys, um, the viewer, and let you guys know exactly what's up. So let's go ahead and get right into it, okay? For the first announcement, there's Twitch. Sure, it's fun, and I actually enjoy streaming, however, I feel as if it's time for me to take a step back for a while and reevaluate what my goals are for the platform. At this point in my life, I have a lot of things going on. It's December, so things are very busy for me. I want to keep making content for YouTube as that's something that is actually growing for me, so this means I need to take a look at how I spend my time and focus on things that I think are important for me. For this, I believe my efforts should be focused more like on YouTube. and. That, that's just for the time being, or at least until I, I grow an audience that's large enough to actually support me when I jump back over onto Twitch. Not to mention that I currently don't use a face cam for Twitch, and I think that that kind of leads me into some problems um, for growth. I don't necessarily know where this puts me with Twitch. You know, I feel that Twitch feeds off a unique audience and streamer relationship. Sure, it's cool, but it doesn't really fit my format. It doesn't really fit where I am as a creator right now. Um, I'm also moving soon which is kind of a distraction for me. Um, for my Twitch fans and for my Twitch friends, this is not because of you. I have nothing against you guys. I absolutely love the community. I love everything that it has going on with it. I love actually what Twitch is, but my indefinite departure is for more personal reasons. Like, I will come back. It's just, I don't necessarily know when. Uh, I need to focus on my YouTube channel, like I said before, and I want to make sure that YouTube is a priority as that is actually something that is growing for me where I can actually see the engagement. I can actually gauge um how growth is going for me so that that's something you know um and to kind of replace the, the twitch thing i will be streaming more on youtube here kind of intermittently so there's some things here that i actually i like i'm very logical so there's some things that i actually wanted to talk about but twitch i do enjoy the community i think the interface is great i think it's easier to use than what youtube is and it is gamer focused which is really good for me because i have video games featured in like all of my videos but that means that there's also some things that I don't like about Twitch. Like, um, there's kind of pressure to show your face. That's not really for me right now. Um, there's also an imbalance of promoted streamers. Like, I feel like other streamers are promoted way above others. Not to mention, I am new, so I, I, I can understand I wasn't promoted. But I do feel like there's some really good streamers out there who are smaller and they're not really being promoted as much by the platform because they're small so it's a catch-22 also monetization becomes very difficult um, and I'm not really sure what the parameters are to become a twitch partner but I know that I'm just not gonna meet them with my current twitch output and, and that's kind of discouraging and disheartening but it's not about the monetization but once again I do know once you reach monetization you know you kind of it's like the catch-22 is over you know you end up getting more views you end up getting more viewers you get more fans things like that and I it just it's just not viable for me at the moment you know the second announcement, I'm going to be talking about my future plans for the channel. So I want to focus on YouTube. And the reason is, is because there's been some really good things that happened for me here on YouTube. Like I started the year, I started YouTube this year and I did take a break, but I started this year with three goals in mind. And those three goals were um, to have 100 subscribers by the end of the year, which I have. Thank you guys so much for that. I really appreciate that. Um, to reach 10,000 total channel views, which I've blown out the water now. I'm almost at 14,000 channel views. That's awesome. And then the last and final goal was to have 56 unique uploads. What that means is I was looking to get one video a week and that didn't happen, but I ended up still getting 56 uploads. So I'm really, really happy about that. And I really do appreciate every single one of you guys for pushing me, for making me want to be better and making, making my content better. So without you guys, I wouldn't have been able to do that. So with that said, I have another announcement. I'm going to be trying to focus on some new video styles. Those are coming out pretty soon. I will be keeping the old video styles like the uh, let's talk about the blank problem. I will be talking, you know, the stoner door videos. I think those are going to continue. False advertisement videos are going to continue. However, there's going to be some new videos I want to um, start. Um, like the, I want to start a video series on Reddit. I'm talking about some different Reddit posts, the, the uh, Let's Be Honest series. I want to kind of expand on that a little bit, kind of touch on more than just Overwatch. So yeah, there's going to be some new video styles coming. I hope you guys really do enjoy those. There's also a new video style I'm talking about. It's called the Addendum series, um, where I get to go back and look at some of my older videos and kind of further clarify my points or, you know, make a, a follow up video with or kind of like, I don't know, it's just like a, a little tack on video that kind of goes along with uh, a bigger overarching video to kind of help kind of 
pad my points a little bit more and kind of you know give you guys a chance to kind of interact more but yeah just, just you know just know that i am keeping that eye i will be also streaming here on youtube that is something else that i want to keep going simply because it does help the algorithm it does help for my channel to grow so just know that that is what's going on here i'm not done with twitch completely i'm just taking a break um, so yeah, you know, with that said, you know, I just want you guys to keep in mind that I'm a small time YouTuber um, and I have a full time job and I got a big booty wife, you know, those things need my attention. I'm sorry to say that as much as I do love making videos and reading each and every comment, those things do come first for me. This is the part where, you know, if I was a larger YouTuber, I would say, you know, guys, go ahead and uh, hit me up on Patreon, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to be real here. I'm not going to do that shit at all. Okay. Uh, you know, or at least not yet. I don't think my content is on the level where I can comfortably ask you guys to support me um, with this on a full-time endeavor. Maybe it will happen one day, but I'm not going to assume that it's going to happen anytime soon. Uh, I'm not even sure if that's going to happen at all, but I just want to talk briefly about some of the new channel goals going forward. The first, I guess this kind of could be like a, a New Year's video, but I'm not, I'll have something else for New Year's, hopefully. The first thing, uh, the first ambitious goal I have for this next year for 2018 is to have 1,000 subscribers by the year 2018. I know that overall, by comparing me to some other YouTubers, that may seem like a small goal, but it's not. That's actually a really huge goal for me. Along the way, I would like to get some more help and some feedback from you guys, um, how I can, you know, improve my videos, you know, or just by dropping a like on the videos you guys do like and dropping a dislike on the video you guys don't like, that actually helps me. Hitting up with the comments, you know, like, you know, explaining to me what you liked, what you didn't like, where I was wrong, you know. Also, you know, if you guys want to help me grow, sharing my videos does help out an absolute ton. I know I'm small and there's going to be a lot of people out there who are just going to flat out refuse to watch my videos simply because I don't have the audience, but that's okay. It, time will, you know, will change that. Another goal that I have, uh, the second channel goal for 2018, is to have 50,000 channel views. Now, I'm currently at 13,000, but I want more. You know, obviously I want more. I want to keep getting better. I want to keep growing. I want to keep on pushing forward. And um, I think 50,000 is an achievable goal within the next 365 days or so. I think it's doable once again with your help by staying active on my channel. Um, hit the notification button so you guys know when I upload new videos. And, you know, I want to make my channel more of a community where we can kind of grow together. It's not just my channel. I kind of feel like it's our channel. I have some really dedicated guys out there who like my content. And I, that is awesome to me. That is so, so cool that there's people out there who actually watch me for me. And I, I really like that. It actually really makes me happy. So I want to grow together, you know. So that brings me into my third goal for 2018, which is to have 150 unique videos uploaded to the channel. So what that means is videos are in a series, channel updates, my funny videos, my commentary videos. I wanna have 150 of those, but I'm not counting re-uploads. So sometimes I mess up on videos, sometimes things don't, like, like I have two adult baby videos that are exactly the same, except for I think one has music and another one doesn't. That, for example, that doesn't count as two videos. That's still one video. I don't wanna count re-uploads or streams with that. So if I live stream something, that doesn't count as a video to me. I know YouTube counts as a video, doesn't count as a video to me. So yeah, to put that in perspective, that means in 2018, I want to upload at least two videos each and every week. And that's tough. It's it's tough for me simply because, you know, I, like I said before, I have a big booty wife. I got a life outside of this. I got a full-time job. But I think that it's, it's something I can do. The fourth and final goal of 2018, which is by far the hardest goal that I want to have achieved, is to get at least one brand deal. Now, I don't know exactly how to do it, and I do know it's actually very difficult difficult goal. When I mean by brand deal, I mean like a sponsored video. I can assure you that making more consistent content will kind of help out with this, but I don't necessarily know how to do it. So I, I guess maybe helping people more is the key to that. Maybe making some more helpful videos. Maybe if you guys like the videos that I've been doing about PC components or maybe about Audacity, let me know how those helped you guys out. If they did help you at all, drop a like, share the video. I don't know. I think maybe going along that path a little bit more will help. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not going to be like replacing my channel with just how-to videos. I'm not doing that. But every time I get questions from people about, hey, you know, how do I do this or how do I do that? It's easier for me to just go make a video on it and upload the video and say, hey, you know, just go check out my video versus explaining it four or five times. So I think that that is kind of like a cool thing that I can keep on the side when I'm explaining some things like that. And I think that that will kind of help me. It's a huge part of securing that type of success and getting like brand deals and getting, you know, sponsorships. So I just wanted to be transparent with you guys. So those are my goals. Of course, I have some more like overarching, like long term goals, but um, I'm not even sure if those will ever happen. Like, for example, I want to do a face reveal for you guys at 100,000 subscribers. That's insane. I know I'm not even close to that. I'm not, I, that's a uh, hundred times more subscribers. No, is it a hundred times more? I, I don't know. I can't math right now. I'm not going to math right now. However, I do know like I want to do a face reveal 100,000 subscribers. Sounds like a far shot, but it's not necessarily impossible either. 
I also want to, um, you know, make a Discord um, server for you guys. So you guys can come and send me super toxic content without the parameters of YouTube censoring. You know, I, I love to be able to engage with you guys on a one-on-one -on -one level, be able to get pictures from you guys messages from you guys be able to engage with you guys so that's something else i want to do i also want to be able to make an instagram where you guys can follow me and i can follow back things like that but it just takes time and it is a dream at this point but it takes time because i have a vision for it and i won't be happy unless the vision is exactly what i wanted for it so just stay tuned that will happen eventually guys i do really appreciate you guys really sticking with me all this time i want to see my channel as a community of people with a very dark sense of humor no matter add, you know a safe space from the worries of SJWs and transracial people, snowflakes and people who want to censor the masses. I want my channel to be that safe space where you guys can go and laugh without having to feel like you shouldn't laugh. Actually, you, you might feel like you shouldn't, but you're going to laugh anyway. Um, if you guys want to join me in my quest to trigger the nation, you know, that's great. I'm not sure what we'll call this gang, you know, but we'll have a gang name one day. I don't know, maybe trash gang, you know, blood gang. I don't know. Taylor gang, something. I don't know. But in time, we're going to develop this channel and make this community even better. With that said, if you guys want to go ahead and drop a like on this video, I'm not going to stop you. Also, subscribe if you're new here because I'm going to be making much more content very soon. Lastly, share this channel, not this video, share this channel with another twisted fuck who likes weird videos. Once again, I'm Neraku, and I will see each and every one of you weird AF mofos in the next video. Thank you, and peace.